Bronny James, LeBron James' son, is a Los Angeles Lakers being selected with Bravo. the pick in the 2024 draft. This makes LeBron and Bronny the first ever father-son duo on the same team in NBA history. Oh, it like happens, it. happens so organically, too. It's just natural the way it happened. It was all natural. Yeah, the way that the way that they, they literally had to do it, or the blonde player, or their or their star player would just probably leave. No, was there rumors that LeBron would leave if they didn't do it? Was that was that was the thing. Well, his, his decision, him deciding to stay there or not, is all completely up in the air. Like he doesn't have to stay oh, okay. there. So, listen, so. I love every piece of this. Somebody that somebody like LeBron James, or you know, so anybody out there that works hard enough to have that level of influence. Um, where, you know, you come from nothing like LeBron and you in a lifetime, you have the ability to say, you know what, I'm going to help my son achieve his dream. I'm obviously I'm. it seems like this is his son's dream, um, but I love it. I love every piece of it, because when you look around at the hierarchy of our corporate entities or football teams and basketball teams, it's a lot of nepotism. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it's his dream, too, though. Didn't he say he wanted to play with his son? Le- no, no, it's it's LeBron's dream. No, I knew that. Yeah. Was we don't yeah. know. Bronny know. actually said. Bronny actually said he doesn't care where he plays. Got. It. I don't know if he meant that or not. Listen, I hear Ebro from a socio political standpoint. It's really nice to see this because nepotism exists in so many parts of America, and usually it's rich old white people giving their underqualified kids jobs. And so Ebro likes seeing this happen in another way. Yeah. But be clear, that is what happened. Yeah. Bronny James is not ready for the NBA. Yeah. His, his pops just gave him a job. Yeah. And I think it's going to play out super nasty. And the and the pressure that well, that's be a on different this story. The, the, the pressure, pressure part. That's why I said I hope brutal. it's his son's dream. Right? Like, I hope this is what, the, what he really wants. I, and I know there's another emotional part to it because his son has worked hard. Super. Yeah. And super hard and had the heart uh, issue. So I, And I know that was super scary. Right. Absolutely. So, so in, in that regard, I think that's why we saw the video of Bronny being very emotional. Um, but a- also this on the socioeconomic side of it. You'll never s- likely see this again in your life. <laughs> right. Well, you mean that a father and son are on the same team? No, in basketball. In basketball, because the father was able to stick around this long. Right. The last time we saw it was the Griffies. Griffey Sr. and Griffey Jr. Right. And Ken Griffey Jr. was a baller. Well, the different that one made more sense because Griffey Jr. was the kid, and everyone knew he was going to. And then once he was drafted to Seattle. Balled out. No, the Mariners did Griffey Jr. a favor and and picked up his over-the-hill dad. Right. This one's different because the dad is still popping and no one knows if the son can play. So this one is very, it's like, it is bizarre world. Now I'll say, I'll say this on the business side, jerseys are going to sell for well, sure. Be- well, that's what better happen because your team's a joke otherwise. Let's just be real. This is. <laughs> You're definitely going to have dads and their sons with the jerseys. No, nah, listen, it's great. Everyone <laughs> has matching James jerseys and, but, and, but, and 38 wins. So but I, hope, I hope you dig it. You think they only get 38 wins? Oh, this team is trash, bro. This team is trash. Celtics are on their way to 19 and 20. The, uh, what are the Lakers doing to improve? I I, mean, is Anthony Davis staying healthy? Are I mean, they giving no, D'Angelo Russell a max contract? I, like, what are they listen, doing? I, listen, 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 listen. I'm going to let you have this moment. Because well, you know isolate it's true. This, I'm going to I'm I'm isolate this audio. I'm, I'm also going to keep receipts because I think Bronny James is better than people think he is. Or maybe his, that well, that would be great. His speed and athleticism and his defensive abilities, I think, are better than people anticipate, for sure. I know his tenacity is be- it means a lot, and he cares about it a lot. I don't know if that's going, but we don't know if it transferred. But I'm gonna give people this moment, have this moment. Like I said yesterday uh, in our text, I think this is a basketball circus, but it's a beautiful story. Hey man, I'm there touched. You go. That's, that's and, your and people will be tuned in to watch.